I've had a headache all day, um, and it's not going away. Um, and for that reason, I decided to take a really light session today at home. You know, the whole thing took me like two, three minutes. Um, this this is one of those things that you can't really fight through. Um, my headache is kind of throbbing. Uh, it's all over, uh, all over the head. Um, you know, lifting heavy weights with a headache is a really silly idea. Um, in order for us to lift heavy weights, we need to brace effectively. Embracing means you're increasing your intra-abdominal pressure to stabilize your lower back, essentially, um, the weakest part of our spine, the lumbar, lumbar spine. Um, so bracing increases intra-abdominal pressure. Intra-abdominal pressure also increases your systemic blood pressure for that moment, especially when you're straining against the bar. Um, now, straining against a heavy weight and having very high intra-abdominal pressure while having a headache is a very, very silly idea because there's already you know, pressure in your head um, and now you're increasing your blood pressure to, I don't even know, I've read reports that you know, our blood pressure in a really strong lift can go up to like 250, 300 uh, millimeters of mercury, which is very, very high blood pressure. It's for a split second and it's required, right? Because if we didn't have you know, that increase in blood pressure, we would faint because the, the blood wouldn't be able to kind of get through to the brain. So our body basically increases that blood pressure for that kind of surge that we're straining. Um, my headache is bad. Uh, I don't really get headaches. Um, but even doing 100 kilos today, um, it was... I could feel, I could feel my head kind of like throbbing even harder. Um, uh, I, I have a feeling, I know why I've got this headache. Um, it's just, you know, we're just in spring now in Australia. And, you know, when spring comes, heaps of pollen, <laughs> what I call tree sperm. Um, and a few days ago, man, it got me real good. Like I was in the garden, you know, mowing the lawn. Um, and I was sneezing like a maniac, you know, runny nose, sneezing, runny nose, sneezing. And it kind of had me for a day, day and a half. Um, and so my sinus is a chocker block. My sinus is a fool. I don't even know if you can hear me, how, how blocked I am, blocked up I am. Um, so I've kind of tried to like clear all this and like, you know, blow my nose and whatever. And I've got a headache. So I think it's all related to that. But regardless of all of that, I, um, I feel not too bad, like systemically. It's just real bad headache, um, runny nose because of this hay fever, if you will, um, and just a real bad headache. So the headache has kind of kept me away from lifting weights today properly. Uh, it's always, you guys know me, man, it's always hard for me to kind of have these days because I'm so damn used to kind of like putting in work and, and, and feeling like I've made another step forward. Um, but, you know, we all have days like this. You know, and this is all part of it. Um, these are the days that make the good days really good, right? When I hit that 210, I think I said in this video, like, you know, that moment then, um, you know, makes all these moments now, you know, worth it. Um, you know, you never know how good a high is unless you felt a low. Uh, without the contrast, you've got no idea. Um, you know, you put everything back into context. You know, I'm a lucky guy, man. Like, this is the worst of, of, of it for me. It's just a freaking headache, which is not a big deal, but... Um, it's, a, you know, if, if you've got a joint ache or like a, you know, hip pain that I kind of usually have had in over, over the last year on and off, you know, you can kind of work through that. Like you can do exercises, you can still kind of work um, and put work in, um, you know, trying to work out, you know, what muscles to activate, what muscles to work out and whatever. You still feel like you're kind of working towards something, but something like this, like a headache, you don't mess around with this. This is like a medical thing. Um, and you don't want to mess around with it. Um, like I said, you know, I mean, 100 kilos I, I did in this clip here. Um, I mean, it's not a lot of weight, but still there is some pressure created in the abdomen. And that pressure, like I, as soon as I went down, I felt like my temples freaking light up. So it's, I could imagine, like I could probably lift 180 today or whatever, but Jesus Christ, like that would be a really, really dumb thing to do. I'll probably blow my head off the shoulders, man. You know, like... Um, uh, they kind of got me thinking. Um, I remember a few years ago, one of the one of the doctors at work who doesn't really train, he said to me that lifting heavy weights is not really a good idea uh, because of this temporary increase in blood pressure. Um, 
he was like, it's not really good for you. You can, you know, develop aneurysms in your aorta. Like he was pulling out all these kind of medical terms. You can kind of, you know, create aneurysms in your head. You can have a bleed. You can, you can pop, you know, basically he was referring to really high blood pressure. You can, you can blow a vessel basically. Um, and I remember at the time, this was like five, six, seven years ago. I remember at the time looking up like quickly, doing a bit of a Google Scholar search. And I remember seeing that um, everywhere I looked, like it was it was a good thing to do, to you know, resistant training. Um, and that temporary blood pressure increase wasn't a detriment to health. But it's something that I you know think about now, especially with a headache. Um, it made me think about, you know, how healthy is it to lift really, really heavy ass weight all the time? Um, I don't know. I mean, lots of people lift heavy ass weight all the time and they're fine. Um, obviously, this is how we're made, right? Like, you know, if you if you lift weights without increasing your intra pressure, you're going to hurt yourself. Uh, but anyway, it's something to think about, something, something, to, um, something to spark my brain today. But anyway, uh, easy day today. Headache day today. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.